Hey folks, I wanted to record a video of this thing before uh, it levels any further and probably bricks what it's trying to do. And let me shut off global because global is awful. Um, so I wanted to level a forge guard because I've never leveled a forge guard. And originally it was like, hey, I'm going to play around with, you know, the minions that you can do with forge guard. But then I started leveling once again with Warpath and, you know, one thing led to another. And now I have gone fully fire with my Warpath and also am in the process of making it smite every second. Uh, and then my smite is also fully fire. <laughs> And, uh, probably next point in smite, I'll, I'll have it drop this fissure. Um, and, uh, cause I'd rather have it stay zero mana cost anyway. Um, so yeah, like, and, and then on top of that, I decided, you know, what the hell I'll, I'll level with Firestarter's torch, which has some really good and some fairly mid stats like fire damage over time. It's pretty good. And the... 21% chance to inflict spreading flames on hit is key because for anybody that's played Path of Exile, that's like Ignite Prolif, and it just kind of goes all over the screen when it procs. Um, I'm also running Calamity just for the increased chance to ignite, and it's dealing damage back to me, but, like, we're dealing with it. It's fine. Um, and then... I threw on two of these sun wreaths, which give me a lot of, of fire resistance, which is hopefully helping with the damage I'm dealing to myself. And then this belt is just because it has a lot of potion slots. So if I get in trouble, then Avarice is giving me elemental damage leached as health. And then I have this stupid Sentinel relic that throws axes while I'm channeling uh, Warpath. And those also can ignite. So, yeah, like this is, it's currently in a silly state. And this is my all legendary outfit, <laughs> minus my necklace. Although I could probably throw on a legendary necklace and, and call it truthfully my, my full legendary. But anyway, so we're going to summon our, our big boy who really doesn't do a lot right now. And we're just going to channel and we're going to watch stuff explode. And I move pretty slow because it's Warpath. But, like, things will just catch on fire and go bye-bye. And it is very silly. And I keep thinking there's no way in hell that this can, can you know, continue for the rest of the game. Um, so, yeah, like... <laughs> And then whenever I fight a boss or whatever, I end up with like 30 stacks of Ignite, uh, which is just silly. Yeah, so it's <laughs> like, like I said, let's let's go in the other direction because um, that's going to go into a town and I don't want to deal with the town. I want to kill more stuff and show, you know, igniting joy. Hopefully we'll have a short loading screen. Um, gameplay has been improving significantly, like loading times have improved significantly, like that wasn't bad at all. Um, but yeah, so I basically just keep rolling in one direction and if I don't insta-gib them, then pretty much, you know, my damage will over time, like, I don't know how many stacks I have on that guy, but a lot. But like for most stuff that you encounter, it just kind of like once when the torch procs, it catches entire packs on on fire and like a 21% chance to proc is pretty low, but it happens a lot. Especially when I was leveling through the campaign, entire rooms would just disappear. Um, I mean, technically, I'm still leveling through the cam campaign, but like those early levels.
And it looks like, I don't know if that was some of that or not, or, but yeah, like this is just silly. Like this is kind of the closest thing that I've, I've played to Righteous Fire in Last Epoch. And you just roll over top of things and catch stuff on fire. And then, you know, your ignites spread and all sorts of nonsense. Like that one, I think, was ignited off one of my axes. Anyway, that's that's it. I just wanted to record this while it was working um, for fear that as I get higher in level, I will have to, you know, pick a normal build where I'm not just equipping a, a ton of dumb uniques. Um, yeah, that, that's that's it. That's the video. Anyway, um, I will probably do a video on my actual build, my Echo Warpath Void Knight, but for now, you know, I'm screwing around on the, the, the Forge Guard, and um, I'm going to try and go heavy into block and see if that gives me survival. Um, and if not, I'll just respec and, you know, play around with the minions. Anyway. That's it. Thanks, everybody.